We are in a situation where every mobile phone manufacturer is thinking of increasing the price due to global inflation, just like what Apple did with iPhone 14 Pro Max. But if we talk about Samsung, Galaxy S22 Ultra this year already peaked $1200 for base model. But the news regarding the Galaxy S23 Ultra is quite surprising since we might see a price jump on Galaxy S23 Ultra. Yes, about a $50 on each model of Galaxy S23 lineup. So the new prices will be $1250 for 128GB version of S23 Ultra, $750 for vanilla S23, and $999 for S23 Plus. But these prices are for the US market. And by chance, if you are from European countries, then this news might be disappointing because we might see a price jump in the S23 Ultra in European market, just like other companies did with their phones including Google with their Pixel 7 Pro. So a safe bet could be 50 euros increase in the price of all Galaxy models including Galaxy S23 Ultra. And if you are disappointed with the prices, then the good news is here for you. The pre-order deals will help you to deal with the price increase on S23 lineup. As per previous reports, the Galaxy S23 and Galaxy S23 Plus will come with the new Galaxy Buds Pro if you pre-order any of this device. But with Galaxy S23 Ultra, we might see the whopping $200 Samsung credit that you can use to buy accessories for your Galaxy device, including the new fast charging adapter and cases. So Samsung managed the price increase with the pre-order deals. If you are thinking why there is no price drop or why Samsung is going to increase the price, then the big internal changes might be the reason for Samsung to retain the price or to increase the price on Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. Yes, there are a couple of new camera features we are going to get in the Galaxy S23 Ultra which could make the Galaxy S23 Ultra the best camera phone of next year. Now with 200 megapixel shooter, Samsung will allow user to record 8K video recording but the pixel will go down to 50 megapixel with pixel binning. And the new portrait video mode is also getting an update. Yes, either 2.8K or 4K resolution unlike Full HD on the S22 Ultra. The selfie shooter might see a downgrade at 12 megapixel or 10 megapixel instead of 40 megapixel just like we have seen on the S22 Ultra. But surely S23 Ultra could be the camera phone of next year. Things didn't stop here. Galaxy S23 Ultra is here to claim another title, the fastest phone of next year. Yes, as per benchmarks and recent reports, Galaxy S23 Ultra is capable of beating a 16 Bionic chipset in GPU performance, which is the first time in recent years. So we should have an eye on Snapdragon Gen 2 launch, because it is going to launch next week. As Samsung plans to launch S23 Ultra in the first week of Feb and phones will hit the market on 17th of Feb. So if you want to see Galaxy S23 Ultra spotted online, then you guys should check this video. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I'll see you next time. Till then, peace out.